Your kit will come with six feet of tubing, as you see here, and a syringe, and you will have to buy your own five gallon bucket. You can get that at a paint store. It also comes with this board. I've had mine for over 20 years now. As you can see, I have the Kalima board placed on a sturdy chair right here. Like that. And with the opening end over the toilet right there, I also have a five gallon bucket that's going to hold the clean water some oil i have some olive oil here your syringe as well as your disposable tip we also have the tubing that you're going to use so the first thing that i like to do is this can be kind of hard so i place a nice soft towel over it bring it up from the end because this end is your bottom is going to be here and you don't want that getting wet so I pull it back a little bit okay this six feet of tubing doesn't come together but it's fairly intuitive there is a u-shaped piece of tubing this is 14 inches with a weight on the bottom when you get it you'll connect it like so and the other end will not be collected connected and you just connect that and push it in together so that you have an entire length of tubing all connected. So just remember the short piece connects with the U and you have it. You have a clamp right here. So the U part is what's going to drape over your bucket. This is five gallons of water. The water should be clean um, drinking water or if you have good water in your shower, some people don't, they filter it, you can use that. This gets pretty heavy. So some people will take it, take the empty bucket, take it to your shower or your tub, fill it that way, and then lift it up onto an area that's about a foot higher than your board. No more than two feet, you don't want more than two feet. If that's gonna be too heavy for you, you might wanna take up a pitcher and just fill it up. It takes a little bit longer, but that's okay. Just remember, this is a nice leisurely activity. Don't be in a rush. Because for this to go through your colon, it's gonna take 45 to 60 minutes. So you wanna schedule some time that's uninterrupted and just be at peace when you're doing it. So you stick the short end, the weighted end down into the water. You'll see that there's a clamp here. You open the clamp because what you wanna do is you want to get the water flowing and for that purposes you have a syringe stick the syringe in you pull it and it should start the water flowing see flowing once it starts flowing clamp it push it down and it stops the flow of water so now you're going to take your disposable tip and connect it to the long six foot tubing with this L shaped tube. Stick it in here. That, if it's new, it might be kind of tight, but just, see? You're going to take this tip. There is an opening on the board at the back, and you're going to stick this L shaped through the little hole. You're gonna take the tip, this side is open. This side, you don't see the little tiny holes. You see them there? So this will be facing you. This part goes into that L shape too. So there's a little hole that I was talking about that the L shape is gonna go in. Stick it through and it comes out. Now this is the tip that is actually going to go in your rectum. And so that's why I have the oil. I use this just for this purpose. I keep it all together. You're going to take, I use olive oil. You're going to oil the tip that has been, you can throw it away or use it again, clean it very well. And you're also going to use this to lubricate your rectum as well. So after everything is set up, I would very carefully lie down and of course, I don't have on my underwear. I don't have on 
um, my pants or anything. And what you're gonna do next is lie down on the board, making sure that your tubing is within reach, it's pointed toward you, as well as your oil, because this oil you're also going to use to massage, massage your abdomen and, and get the colon stimulated and, and move feces. So you scoop down towards the end, lie down comfortably, and as I mentioned before, the tip is lubricated. So at this point, you would come down closer, insert the tip into your rectum very easily, and slide down until you know that it cannot go anymore. There are grooves in here for your feet, so you put your feet there. Sometimes I'll even lift mine up and, and rest them on the back. It just feels more comfortable because for 45 to 60 minutes, you know, sometimes I just like to move around a little bit, so I'll move it like so. Once you are in position, you now take the clamp and you open it. When you open the clamp, it allows the water to start flowing through the tube, all the way through the tube, and it comes inside of you, inside your colon. So what you can do now is take some of the oil and just start massaging your stomach very gently, very gently, very gently. And very soon you should feel the stool coming out of you, going through the hole and into the toilet. It's gonna take, like I said before, 45 to 60 minutes. Once that is done, once you run out of water, you're going to go ahead and clamp it back again, very gently move back as you're getting the tip outside of your rectum. Move up, go ahead and get up. At this point, I usually, that's where I have some toilet paper. It's gonna, it's gonna be kind of messy. And you take your toilet paper, I wipe my rectum, throw the toilet paper into the toilet, get up, very carefully come around. And at that point, you do the reverse. Uh, I usually get some gloves at this point. I'll take some water and while it's still set up, I'll just throw the water and clean everything off. I'll take disinfectant, have my gloves on, I'll squirt, squirt, squirt. And at that point, that's when I will do the reverse. I'll pull out the tubing, everything, wash that. I'll run some disinfectant through here, water for uh, several minutes, make sure everything is nice and squeaky clean. I will take this, put it in the shower and scrub it because this I've had for over 20 years. It will last quite a long time if you take good care of it and just clean it, clean it very well. And that is how you do a colonic at home with